Shebengo says he will not pursue partisan politics. CCC Secretary General Mr. Senjizo Chibengu said yesterday he would not pursue partisan politics but will push the national agenda interrogating issues that will help improve people's lives. In an interview soon after he and 13 others from CCC were sworn in as senators and members of the National Assembly, Mr. Chibengu said he will push national issues affecting the country such as the El Nino drought infrastructure development and social services delivery. This is the beginning of a new chapter of politics in Zimbabwe where we are going to focus on issues of national importance and not partisan politics," said Mr. Chibengu. He said the CCC was alive and warned those CCC members who were fence-sitting to embrace his leadership for their good. The movement is very much alive. We have been sworn in today. We are in charge of this movement and we are going to discharge our duties," said Mr. Chibengu. Time is ticking away to those fans sitting. They need to embrace the moving train. We are the people. We are an alternative. We need to benchmark. We need to put the government on its toes. We need to put ZANU-PF in terms of policy framework. We are not going to pinpoint each other as ZANU-PF or CCC. But we are going to differ in terms of policy direction, principle, ideology, policy framework, but we will remain Zimbabwean. He said would push issues affecting the country and give suggestions on how they ought to be addressed. We are facing drought, said Mr. Chibengu. We need to make sure that no one starves or dies of hunger. We are going to hold the government accountable. Look at the state of our roads. Hospitals. We are going to make sure that these issues are addressed. During the swearing-in, Mr. Chibengu was applauded from the floor as he walked toward Senate President. CDE Marble Chinomona, as is the parliamentary protocol for new legislators. Holding on to his traditional walking stick and putting on his trademark smile, Mr. Chibengu greeted C.D. Chinomona. Amid the applause, the 13 legislators in both the Senate and the National Assembly were replacing those that were recalled by the party. They were all party list seats where parties were allocated numbers based on their support in the August elections. The 13 filled the vacant CCC seats in the National Assembly assigned for women and youth quotas and the party list seats in the Senate after the incumbents were recalled following letters written by Mr. Chibengu saying they had ceased to be legislators. Senators who took the oath of office were Senjizo Chibengu, Lillian Lilo, Kukaka Avimofulu, Linda Sibanda, Colitan Lovu, Sam Chapfadza, Maxwell Mbluri Teresa Kabondo and Grace Mumpend. In the National Assembly those that took oath were Nomvila Mguni, Otilia Sibanda, Lanjal Mkub, Sibinjal Mafosa and Saikafi Kyle Dubey. Last week, the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission published their names in a government gazette, saying they had become legislators with immediate effect. Leave your comments in the comment video below, don't forget to share with your family and friends.